Talking Conversation Podcast. Talking Conversation, 021. Back, man. Got another one, man. Got my guy on today, man. My real guy. My life. Well, my life, man. Want to introduce yourself? Go ahead, man. They got rid of geek. Go ahead. Yeah, my life, Jay, man. You know they call me Jay. What's going on? Is it loud? Is it loud enough? Yeah, talking a bit so we can we can hear. You know, we hear some. My life, Jay. Facts. Facts, though. <coughs> yeah. Nigga geeked up. Yes, yeah, sir. Nigga geeked already, man. We. Really, man. Honestly, I ain't think I'm gonna go like this already. Man, you got nothing talking about already. Man, you got some geek shit. I already told you how this go, nigga, when I started smoking. When I started smoking during, nigga can't think of nothing. I'm chilling, man. <laughs> Bitch turned to a smoke session. On God, good smoke <laughs> session. On God, good smoke session, bro. I'm telling you, bro. You know what you can add me though. You can add me hella shit though, cause you know you be talking about hella shit though, hella crazy ass shit. Bring, okay. bring the crazy shit on that bit, then fuck it. Yeah, bring the crazy shit out. Nigga be saying crazy. Yeah, we can go ahead. We can go ahead and go there, man. What are your thoughts? <laughs> what are your thoughts on the? I don't know. I be with this nigga every day, so like, it's crazy. Like, we should be talking all the time. So like, now they shit in our face. It's crazy. Ain't got nowhere like no starting point. Once we get a starting point, that's over. Okay. <coughs> <coughs> nigga know how I feel about everything. on some funny shit though. All right, Pat. So I got this. You know, my man. He 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 really from Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? Some niggas, some niggas be cap. You know about where they be from and shit like that. So how was it? You know, is it the stereotypical? Growing up in the hood is it a stereotypical way or uh, how? How is that? What growing? Just growing up in the hood, how that feel? Yeah, like what's the? Yeah, <coughs> like you know how the stereotype says. Is it? Yeah. Is it? Is it along those lines? You say? Um. Shit, the way people put it, that shit really how it is though. I that be shit. saying that too. Stereotypes that shit, do be true though. That shit really how it is though. Like to my niggas who ain't really got it like that. That's why they out there. Cause they ain't got it like that. You might get like little gifts and shit every now and then, but. Niggas ain't nobody really had it like that for real until they start making their own money. They really had to go though. God, nigga ain't had no money in the goddamn hood, but we used to, we used to some crazy shit for some money, but yeah, I get fucked. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, you know, everybody need money. You know what I'm saying? These and and I feel like people will not do anything, but I feel like you know, folks gonna folks gonna try to feed themselves. They gonna do whatever the fuck they gotta do to 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 survive or do what they do. And I feel like you know. Um, it's the government put folks in that position type to do to do shit like that all the time. Yeah, but uh, they know that though, you know. Niggas don't want to help nobody who ain't who can't help themselves, man. Niggas need that bit reimbursed every time. Oh God, niggas always want that shit back. That's why you help the rich. The rich can always help you. Yeah, you yeah, no cap because they rich. Yeah, correct. so it's just a, a what's name. So I do I don't I do kind of see I do understand you know why they. Do it the way they do it, but at the same time, they ain't got to do it that way. Like, then again, you know, I feel like you know, black folks can uh, we just so I don't know. I feel like I feel like we everywhere though. Like as far as minds, you know, everybody be on their own shit, and, and and rightfully so. But if we want to do anything, like as far as as a whole, and start being in the position we in, we're gonna have to really, really come together. But I really don't see, I really don't see that happening, honestly. What you talking about, like in the in the poverty type shit. Here a great example, like Trump, you know, like them folks came to the Capitol, like they was protesting, like yeah. they was out there. Black folks, you know what I'm saying? Niggas die in the street. Niggas are really gonna do nothing. They'd rather record and do something. Like as, as far as shit like that, that's what I'm saying. Like we gotta stop this, this victim. I feel like it's a victim mentality. I feel like niggas is um, the, uh, rightfully so, yeah. I feel like black folks, you know, have been fucked, you know, for like just a long ass time. But, End of the day, we gotta stop all this praying and and all this hoping shit gonna get better. Cause at the end of the day, you gotta do something. You gotta start some action. Yeah, you gotta do something. Gotta start some action. <clears throat> like folks be trying to, we trying to, 
niggas ain't all in on doing that though. Every right. everybody not all in on you know doing shit for the next man and all that shit. Cause a lot of niggas be thinking about that shit like nigga ain't gonna do it for me. That's really just how people think about shit. Niggas ain't gonna do it for them. That's how black people think though. Yeah, they want it. They want it back instead of just instead of just putting that good it putting that good out in the universe and just knowing you're gonna get it back in return. You know, just just helping out. I ain't gonna lie. Once you once you realize that if you if you do good, you're gonna get good back. That's just how the world works. Like yeah. at the same time, shit. If niggas ain't got nothing, niggas gonna do what they gotta do. No facts. God, oh, that shit crazy. That poverty shit just probably ain't gonna never end. Though you seen that shit? Um. Did you see that shit on Instagram or whatever? Like, um, you seen that shit on Instagram when they were like, um, was it in Cali? I want to say it was in Cali, bro. They had, um, did like mini homes for homeless people type shit. You seen that shit? No, I didn't see that. They made like thousands of like mini homes for like homeless people that they can just go in and just. I ain't gonna lie, it's a lot. It's a lot of homeless folks. I ain't gonna lie, Atlanta, like you go downtown and shit like that, it just be. You know, junkies, homeless folk, it's just like, it's really like that. That shit bad, bro. That shit bad for real. Like, every bridge, every and bridge is home to somebody on some shit. Like, that shit crazy. And you see, like, it's just, and it's, and it's, and it's just like, and, and it's our kind, though. Like, you don't see that too many white folks that's homeless. Maybe because we're not around white folks, but it is, like, you know, just disturbing to see that. You know what I'm saying? It's hella white. It's hella homeless white people. Oh, it is? Hella. I see them niggas all the time. Shit. Okay, so. You know, you know, white folks they can keep people out of the house and not give a fuck about them. A lot of black niggas ain't got, ain't got shit. They just stay with their moms and pops and shit. Yeah, facts so. though. I ain't gonna lie. You, you gotta get, to even get out of that environment. You gotta, you gotta see stuff. You gotta like, so you can think about stuff. So you can just be bigger. Yeah. So you just think big. You know what I'm saying? Like, you ain't. I wouldn't say go to college to get no degree, but shit, just being, just being out. You know, just seeing shit. You know, thinking about new shit that you never would have thought of. You stay in your same environment. So taking care of yourself. Yeah, got that, it. That's the main thing. Self love. Got to take care of yourself. That's the main thing you learn from college, though. Like, you really gonna learn to take care of yourself. Like, and you gonna be out there, like, cause nigga ain't got no mindset to be no adult, bro. Niggas ain't gonna never be no adult, bro. Niggas ain't gonna never grow up. You gotta. You, I ain't gonna lie. The the adult shit. The adult shit is hard, but shit, you gotta if you wanna. If you can feed yourself, you gotta be a dog. That's why I consider to be a dog when you feed yourself and you got nobody to worry about you. Yeah. Like just on some shit. Like you starve, you just gonna starve. Hey, Speak, yeah, speaking of, you said what though? I said that college shit, that shit that shit give you some some independence though. That shit make you feel like you need to do something. You feel me to keep that shit going to be by yourself type shit. You ain't gonna never wanna go back to On God. And then once you once you get this type of freedom where you actually doing, you know, what the fuck you wanna do and shit like that, you're not gonna go back to the crib, I promise you. <laughs> not going to go back to the crib. Shit too I be going home, be fucking miserable. Like, it ain't, and I can still go out and do what I want, which is like, I'm not in my shit. Like, all my shit here, though. So, I don't go home. <laughs> <laughs> I don't go home. I don't even want to be there. What I got to be there for? Probably stop to see somebody. Shit, over with. Yeah, it be like a little quick, you know, a little two hours, you know, hey, how y'all doing? Shit like right. that. Get some food, you know. I ain't going to lie. The food place is back. Back on the south side, man, the hoes hard. Food up here just real regular, like, like I, that's why we eating the same shit all the time up here. This shit is oh, this crazy. Shit regular, <laughs> God. Let's say that shit real regular. How that shit going? Yeah. Oh yeah. Back had a break in action. <laughs> like I said, also NBA shit. This nigga ain't getting my shirt yet. <laughs> Not actually, NBA. actually, it's crazy. Eat that. Oh God. Yeah. Actually, yeah. you know, I had, you know what I'm saying? I've been, you know what I'm saying, bro. I, I just forgot to get a red shirt before we started, but yeah. you know, it's right there. You gonna, uh, you gonna show the folks though? Oh yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, like I repeat, oh, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah O21, this oh, is what this man. podcast is. Uh, That'd be hard. He got the other logo. I got, you know, these, these are, this the other logo, but you know, I got, I got two of them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Facts, man. Yesterday, man, was a depressing day for me. I just wanted to speak on this and get it out of my system. Um, many may not know. Y'all probably don't know my love for Patty, man. But um, I just feel like he was just whole yesterday. Niggas was missing. 
Niggas was missing catches yesterday. I actually didn't even watch the second half. I just couldn't take it no more. Hey, Tom Brady the GOAT. I know this nigga don't even want to hear this, but Tom Brady is the GOAT. Gotta, we, me and him had to talk about this shit, right? Tom we, Brady is the GOAT. We had to talk about this shit. We say, whoever win this shit, gonna, gonna claim that they the GOAT, bro. I told this nigga, if Pat Mahomes don't beat Tom Brady the first time, bro, even if he beat him the second time, it's over with. Tom Brady is gonna be considered the GOAT. That's all I need to say to him right here, right now. Tom Brady, man, he he hard. I'm a fan of greatness. Like I love greatness. So yeah. Tom Brady is great. Nah, you know, nigga done won seven of them. He got more. You really just can't deny, bro. He got more Super Bowls than every franchise. Than every franchise. That shit hard. Like one nigga got more Super Bowls than every franchise. And yeah. I, and yeah. You, if you really think about football and just how physical it is. How hard it is to a season through a season just to maintain. That's why it is hard. Like, but if you wanna, uh, if you wanna get that man for one game, you know, you just gotta get him. That's why next year, you know what I'm saying? If he don't get hurt, shit, they might, you know. I think it'll be the same matchup next year. Same matchup next year, man. I'm predicting it right now. Same matchup next year. Tired? You feel me? They gonna tie oh yeah, my my man's get the predictions right. You know what I'm saying? You need some, you know, you wanna bet on some. You know what I'm saying? He he, he pretty lucky when it comes to uh, bets and shit like that. Telling you he gonna the Chiefs, the Chiefs gonna win next year, but ain't nobody gonna give a fuck. <laughs> they gonna win. Patty gonna be yo. Patty's back on top, but it's just gonna, it ain't gonna be. Then it ain't gonna be, be the same one. greatness. He'll be two and one. It ain't gonna be the same greatness. He'll be two and one. And then what if he go off to win? You know, seven I believe, more. I believe, just because he I lost believe, to him. I believe Pat Mahomes is probably gonna win the most championships. Like it, I I feel like after Tom Brady leaves, nothing nobody can do. There's nothing nobody can do. Like, you can have that stat ass team the Buccaneers got. Put another quarterback there. It's not going to work the same. Look at Baker Mayfield. I ain't going to lie. They, I don't know. Like, I didn't, I, I, don't, I ain't even watched the highlights, but just the first half, they was getting clamped. No, nah, they, like, they was running, they was running like a, zone, a deep zone to where it, it was basically like a triple team on Tyree Hill. Yeah. And they was running like soft coverage. So if you throw it short, they was already ready yeah. to tackle. For like your little three yard, yeah, five fact. yard passes, so it was really yeah. No I way. feel like, and then also, you know, it was a few plays where I feel like Tariq had a ball, he should have caught touchdown, and then back in the end zone. Hardman had I remember a ball, the, he could have caught touchdown. Uh, Travis Kelsey had a ball in that big third down. I think when they punted that off, Tariq. you know, yeah. you remember when they got the stop on the on, on the running back, yeah. And then Chiefs supposed to do something with that. They did something with that, you know, momentum switch, you know, yeah. The Tariq, game all about momentum. Tariq Hill dropped two of them hoes. Huh. But I ain't, I ain't they gonna was lie. nervous. I'm not gonna lie. It, it ain't had nothing to do with being nervous though. What it had something to do with it? <laughs> hey, no cap, bro. I got to do what I give Pat Mahomes credit right here, man. That nigga, that nigga was making throws that I'm pretty sure the wide receivers was out there like, man, that ball ain't finna get to me. <laughs> yeah, no cap though. Niggas just throw, dropping balls, hit, bro. It hit him in his face, bro. He been catching this shit all season, bro. He didn't think that ball was gonna get to him. That's what's going on, like, bro. Like Pat Mahomes did this not nigga, play bad. Like this nigga is falling. That's what made me upset, cause you know what I'm saying. But that's bro. that's to show how hard football is. Like it, you, just one man can't one man can't do it all, bro. You know, this nigga be falling. He was falling and throwing them holes straight into niggas' faces, bro. If you trying to catch that shit, what you gonna think? And it's a nigga in front of you for the pick, and that I shit knew, gonna go perfectly. I knew, the pick? I knew it was time over. With. I ain't gonna lie. You know, earlier, you feel what I'm saying? We was watching uh, some YouTube videos earlier that day. We seen a Tom Brady ad. And it was real. It looked like it was like a championship. Like, he had won. Like, that's the vibe of it. And I just wondered, was it rigged? Oh, yeah. When I, they told me when I had called that shit out. I was you don't like, got it. Yeah. Like, that shit, like, how fuck? you going to have a, 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 a the ad? In Super Bowl at 6.30. We was, I was probably watching like, a little, little YouTube video at 1.30, 2 o'clock. And it was like an ad, like, as if he had already won. Like, so, I don't know. Maybe this shit is scripted. Nah, that shit ain't scripted, homie. Cause Pat Mahomes would have been the perfect script, the new goat. Man. I be thinking about shit not scripted, like. But then again, I I know like you know niggas at the end of the day they got to go out there catching balls and hit niggas. But then again, niggas shit, dropping that balls. Shit not I don't easy, know. Though. All that yeah, shit not ain't. easy when it's done at the highest. Like, oh yeah, you played uh you played a little football. <laughs> you played a little football at uh elementary school, middle school, high school. I played a little football, man. Hey. Any nigga play football, man. Shout out to y'all country ass niggas, man. Country. Y'all nigga doing some shit that niggas ain't gonna yeah, do. Yeah, no y'all, y'all got, got y'all different. Y'all got, got a different I got, mindset. I got the like I had a coach, nigga. Got a coach with him. We cool as fuck. 
nigga begging me to play football every year just because a nigga, you feel me, look like he can play some football. I can play football. I was hard. I was straight when I played. Coaches, I can do what I coaches, do. coaches yeah. do that. You know, a lot of coaches they may be like, "Shit, you like you can play some football." Yeah, but he was on. We was already cool though, so he right. was just on some shit. Like you, you might as well play football for me, bro. You yeah. used to play football. I tell you, I didn't. No coach ever came to me and said, "Rich, you can play some football." Huh? Yeah, <laughs> tight shit. But yeah, that shit making some noise. Ain't put that bitch down, bro. <laughs> tight shit. That shit on flow. <laughs> but goddamn, yeah, <laughs> bro, <Bruh>, geek. <laughs> man, chill, bro. Chill. I was, I was playing it out good enough. <laughs> Your eyes look shut on this bitch though. Like if y'all watching on Spotify, y'all can't see. But if you're on YouTube, y'all can see. <laughs> y'all can see this shit. Should I play? I play a little football too though. But uh, my short brief football career. Um, uh, my first year I didn't really play like that. Uh, second year I was number sixty. I played quarterback. Sixty, bro. Yeah. Um, Don't get this nigga the ball. He got on <laughs> sixty and he loves his hair like that. Hey, I was a what quarterback. Can what can no, you do? I came his back. number is gonna restrict him from all the skills no, that he's supposed no, to have. And, and that's real <laughs> shit though. And numbers numbers number can do 60, that. Bro, you got a number sixty. It's gonna restrict you. It from was everything sixty or, or, or it was sixty do. or eighty four because I came back from a trip late <laughs> and everybody had to pick their numbers. And that's the only thing they left. You been at wide receiver? You been nah, hard but as fuck though. Fuck no, not not back then. I was real slow. I'm I'm kind of slow now. Because you got on eighty four at wide receiver, you was gonna go crazy though. It's the numbers work in football. But the quarterback was that. You got some bullshit in football. You gonna get clamped. Quarterback starting to hit me, then we never scored for like three, four games. You know, I went, I played for Fabin Flames. You know, everybody know Fabin Flames with ass as fuck. You know, we used to really Fabin Flames used to blow them niggas out. She All right, sweet. so that's good. Niggas was like the, the mock around anyway, town on some shit. Yeah, and, and, and we was. I ain't even gonna cap. We probably had a few hard niggas, but for the most part, hell no. But you know, I threw a little touchdown. You feel what I'm saying? You thought you were the shit that day, didn't you? Yeah, great. It's a great feeling. Y'all got blew out though. Y'all, yeah, we did. Seven, we seven did. Or what? Seven. Seven. Or what? Seven thirty-three. I'm not. See, I'm hey, not a capper. I, hey, nah, I'm not. A, I come up. I be predicting this. Shit. I just know. I be knowing. Like, I know. Say he said he threw a touchdown. Seven to what? <laughs> seven to what? Thirty what? Hey, I got. I got <laughs> smacked though. Nigga smacked me while I was throwing. It was on some and one shit. I ain't even know we scored on oh, some shit. Was I was on getting some up. green release shit. Oh God, I was getting up. I was getting up. Everybody was screaming this. I'm hey. like, we score. I threw that bitch. That's crazy. The one touchdown, bro. Throw he don't even <laughs> see the nigga. <laughs> hey, the nigga I threw to name was Jermaine Lucky. I remember, bro. Oh, name. I remember, bro. Oh God, yo ball, yo yo that, touchdown ball. That was bro. your touchdown. Oh God, <laughs> oh God. I'm dead, bro. You funny as hell, boy. Okay. No uh, then uh, my next year, uh, that's when I stopped playing football because niggas was getting a little too big. You know. Is that that time, you know, the eighth and ninth grade or seventh and eighth, you know, niggas, niggas start filling their bodies. Well, not now because niggas is shrimps now, but back in the day when niggas were actually grown men in middle niggas, in middle school and high school. Niggas little as fuck now. These niggas ain't nothing but little boys out here. <laughs> niggas ain't growing up. Nobody growing up no more. Niggas, stop eating that bullshit. Stop eating that bullshit and stop playing the game. I need to take y'all young ass outside niggas and get some growing, scrapes or something. Niggas ain't growing up. Niggas just long as fuck. Nigga, niggas, no scrapes on niggas the body. Niggas ain't even long. These niggas are short as fuck. I seen. I nah, seen they either long as fuck or short as fuck, though. Man, I seen some ninth graders, bro, had the book bags on their back. The book bags was too big. How the fuck you in high school and your book bag too big? I ain't gonna That's lie. Impossible. You go on that bitch. If you go on that bitch, it, it's gonna seem like. It's gonna seem like. If you go on that bitch, you might be like, are you in the right grade? Are you in seventh, sixth grade? Because niggas look that shrimp. Foreign exchange student looking at a nigga. <laughs> <laughs> y'all, had some, y'all had some foreign exchange students in your high school? Hell nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all did? But they only used to be there for like, probably like a month. Why? Why they look? I don't know what the fuck was going on, bro. Them niggas used to get bullied, for real. Damn. Hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, we had a nigga at our high school, man. This nigga, hey, 10th grader. You feel me? Nice size. He probably like 6'4". He had a tall nigga. Damn, 6'4", 10th grader? He like what the fuck? fuck? Yeah. But, bro, ball head, though. So, that just take away from his whole, like, bro. I don't know why, bro, ball head, bro. But this is the foreign exchange thing was ball head? Nah, this this was a regular nigga. This nigga oh, the re- was just oh, the 6'4", six four, six nigga was ball but head. But ball head, though, on some normal shit, though. Awesome, but not because it, 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 he had no disease, man. He's just bald I don't head. know. I was, don't know. Yeah, we, you gotta watch out for niggas. Niggas, asked, niggas, 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 niggas asked bit. him though. He said, "Ain't nothing wrong with him." Oh, what shit? What the fuck? I don't know. So, L- L- Cool J. Shit. But niggas, niggas start calling bro Michael Jordan, bro, and that's when that shit got too funny. Because bro was the same skin color, six four nigga out there looking like he supposed to be hooping, nigga. Six, Michael four, Jordan, black as fuck, black as hell, bro. Black as hell, bro. Niggas would have bought him some hoop earrings. Like those shits would have been funny. Cause you know Michael Jordan used to wear the little hoop. God. Bro, get to wearing that shit. That shit would've been too funny. Wow. Niggas I don't know we had no foreign exchange. We probably like three white folk, three four, three four, five white nah, folk. Nah, we, we had white people, bro, but they used to um they used to have them niggas in a whole nother class. 
Like, yeah. them niggas, like, we had some shit called AP. Yeah. That was basically for the niggas who wanted to get, like, Everything who wanted to me. feel like they were smart, but right. they just on some shit. Like, they just want to. But my, from my hearing, a lot of folks who was in them type classes said they didn't get no work. Nah, we, we didn't. I was in that shit. Facts. I was shit. in that shit. But you don't get nothing but an extra. Hey, you get to be AP, go do that shit, man. You, you get an yeah, extra get 10 chance, points on your grade. I wasn't. Get I it. wasn't. <laughs> see, me, my get grades were not when they would be AP. Just let y'all know that. Shit, man, I don't want either. I don't know how the fuck I got in that. It was because I was already in the honors program because I have been. I've been in that shit since like first grade, bro. Like always in the smart ass class when I'm really just trying to be a regular nigga. I'm just trying to be a regular nigga, but <laughs> they had me in a regular class crazy, being crazy a regular thing, nigga. Crazy thing is though, when I had went to goddamn school, I had went to like a little academy, bro. At one point, and niggas ain't never put me in no honors class. I wanted to go to academy to hoop. I was. Thank you. I'm lying. To hoop. Yeah, mm, nigga, I was in like elementary school, crazy. I wanted to go to Riverside Academy. I think it was called Riverside Academy just to hoop because I wasn't getting no playtime and shit. My ninth grade, yeah. Well, I, I, I wasn't getting playtime. I just wanted to, you know, star. I just wanted to be star, shoot all the shots. I ain't gonna cap. I used to, I used to start and just be happy with starting. I don't know why the fuck I ain't take that shit in this level. I used to be nervous as I used fuck to, when yeah. I used to start in high nigga, school. Nigga, oh my nigga. god, talk yeah. about. See, I can talk about this now. See, back then, probably not. But right now, man, a nigga was nervous as. fuck Fuck, like I'm, just all I can say is it's crazy. Bro, I just wanted, to, <laughs> I didn't want to get taken out the game, bro. And it's crazy because you would rather niggas would rather just settle with just not doing anything and being and then just and not being taken out the game than just being taken out the game for trying, bro. That's crazy, bro. I just get taken out the game for 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 the little shit. The coaches, be yeah, that kind of that kind of fuck with a nigga psyche though when niggas get you get taken out for like one little thing for a mistake. Yourself. But just being a human, yourself. really, you yeah. get taken out for being a human make mistakes, so you just, really taken out for being a human. But not even though Just trying to do shit That you been working on with Yeah him, fact though. Just trying to You, you, you get this yeah. nigga On these drills But he try to go use it In the game And you on his head You on his head Cause he missed it Like damn nigga, Niggas don't miss no more <laughs> Yeah no cap I wouldn't even elite? My shit was like More defense I'd be scared for a nigga Cause I know A nigga be so nervous To play defense That's how nervous A nigga be Niggas just be so tense. Nervous to play defense. A nigga just stand his thing. Oh, you said you was so nervous that you couldn't pay attention to what was going on. on no, the I was I so nervous. So you just want to play so perfect that you just don't play at all type shit. I know what you mean, but I ain't gonna lie. In high school, niggas used to play some defense though. Nigga, nigga one thing a nigga was running cause just because that's how I knew I was gonna stay in the game if I kept running hard on defense. Yeah, so man, we got like, we got we got one of them. We got one of these niggas right here that the stay in the game had to play D. Just having that mindset on the team. Just, just be gotta, wanting to play D, though. Yeah. You got to want to play D. You got to want to play D. Like, niggas need to start. Like, these niggas, I done seen some of y'all corny-ass niggas keep trying to take y'all children to these damn gyms, bro. Shoot around with them. And I understand that's bonding time and all, all that shit, bro. But you know you can't hoop, bro. Stop trying to teach these niggas these weak-ass moves yeah, that you know it, you can't please. do nothing with. Yeah, y'all got to stop. You, you got to be realistic. a trainer, bro. Yeah. Like, bro, come you gotta on. Be, you got to just sitting down with yourself and being realistic. Like, you being an asshole. You, you ruining that teach. nigga life. You trying to teach? You trying to teach your kids something that you weren't even proficient? You in. don't even know how to do. Imagine, ima- That's kind of imagine trying to teach your child how to be great at tennis, and you've never played tennis in your life before, or you just was always knowing bad. me though. The type of nigga yeah. I am, I'm so competitive. I will go try to learn how to play tennis. Just so but you gonna try to teach him though while trying to learn? That's selfish. Oh, I guess so. That's selfish as fuck. Well, nigga, I'll be to, one but of them dads. I'll be one of them dads bad. though. You gonna be one of them dads. I'll be one of them dads. <laughs> <laughs> you see this shit, bro? In about what, thirty years, nigga? And your pops? Oh, what the fuck, nigga? <laughs> now, nigga years. ain't gonna want to see this shit until you like sixteen, bro. You tripping? Thirty bro. years. Niggas, niggas gonna want to see this shit when they ten? Nah. Oh, this shit. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like when you when you when you find this shit, you, find, you know niggas be looking into the, on their parents yeah. and shit, find crazy shit. It's gonna be the it's gonna be in the archives, hopefully. Nah, I'm telling you, bro. This nigga funny. Bro. I need to buy a hard drive just so I can save all the what's the names on here. I already delete them. But yeah, y'all y'all dads, bro. Y'all niggas. Y'all gotta chill, bro. Go get that nigga a trainer, yeah. or just like go on YouTube and find some drills for this nigga to do. Yeah, it don't it don't take that. You can't keep trying to show him your. Don't jump even shot. matter of fact. Don't even do drills. Just me personally. If you talking about just on some hooping shit, you gotta get a you gotta get experience too. Yeah, experience and, and you gotta every team. And you gotta just know movement. It really, really all it is. Know how your kid move if he fast or slow. You can't have a nigga trying to do make fast, that nigga fast though. You gotta make that nigga fast. He young. Mm-hmm. He can get all them. This is when he get all these abilities though. If you work on, on that some shit, superhero with him, shit. Not, nah, yeah. <laughs> on some super, on some superhuman shit though. Like when these niggas get born as superhuman, these niggas be picking that shit up early as fuck. That's my why son, niggas, my son doing push. If I have a son, my son doing push-ups out the gate. 
You feel me? I wish a nigga telling me to do push ups when I was a fucking kid. Niggas hey, would been doing the fuck out of We doing push-ups. I ain't gonna lie, my son ain't gonna be one years old. We but doing push ups and we we doing sit ups and we and we getting our cardio in. Think early. about it. Think about it though, bro. Think about if you was a young nigga trying to do push ups and your goal was ten. You would be like, Shit, I could do ten. Oh god. I'm gonna do them hoes like now, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, when I do push ups now, I try to really feel it in my muscles, so I go slow as fuck. Try to get a good strain. Man. I tried to do some push ups this morning. I felt stupid as <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck are you doing, nigga? Why are you trying to do some push ups, nigga? What are you trying to gain from push ups, nigga? That's how I felt, nigga. Fuck some push ups. Fuck around, look like, look like the baby of fucking the army, what army wrong? reserve. Niggas, niggas, niggas. Hey, the baby, the baby is a fucking. The baby was a was a was an army sergeant. Bro was, was in the army. Bro. bro was in. The, bro was in. Nah, not the army. Bro yeah. was, even worse. Even worse. Bro was in the um. In the fucking what's the shit? The National Guard. Yeah, bro. You swore to be in the guard. National Guard. I ain't, I ain't finna. The baby was a National Guard. Him, that's why bro's so swole. I know a National Guard nigga when I see him. Oh, I know a National that's Guard. That's National. That's a National Guard body he got. <laughs> <laughs> bro, I'm some bulldog shit. Why bro's so oh, swole though? Like, bro, bro, I'm so swole. But you rap though. I just been a swole rapper though. Like, what's that? Some eight nineteen eighty shit. Yeah, that's some. Yeah, no cap though. It is though, bro. Some, some freak shit. shit. He on some juvenile shit. I call that freak shit. Anything, anything dealing with that type of shit, call that freak shit. <clears throat> That's crazy. Oh, we're going crazy. Oh God, <laughs> bro, pull some. Hey, I be shit. having. Hey, during the podcast, you know, if if anybody ever get the opportunity to come on, you know, I be having a smooth, uh, little study mix in the back. Sometimes, you know, it's just. Just help shit flow. Oh, yeah. I was gonna say something. We were just talking about uh, shit. Fake hooping ass pops. She was yeah. talking about some shit before that though. No, after that though. <laughs> after that. Some geek shit. On some geek shit though. See, we were having to geek. I was gonna. It was gonna segue into a whole nother thing. I had it too, but I said something else on some. I'm trying to talk too much. Episode 21, man. Oh, God, you gotta say, keep saying episode 21. We get a break. We ain't need motherfucking, man. Talk conversation, man. Talk conversation, man, by Rich. I ain't even do that in the fucking intro like I usually do. <coughs> nigga is feeling burnt, though. Niggas geek, man, but we lit. Yeah, we man, nigga is geek. Well, we not, see, but I'm not a person who just get geeked all the time. You know, I like to, you know, put, put some work in and let the geekness be my reward. I like reward myself. I put myself on a reward system on some parent bro, shit. Bro, some slave shit. <laughs> you can oh, have slave weed. shit. You can have weed after you work. <laughs> <laughs> two grams today, master. On <laughs> some begging shit. Can I get two? <laughs> you ain't from. You ain't from Africa, nigga. You from fucking Arabia. Can I get oh. two? Question. Speaking of slaves and gas, you think slaves smoking gas? Do you think smoking gas for the slaves would make the experience think, better? Hey, hey, hey. I think, <laughs> I think slaves were smoking anything, <laughs> smoking anything they can get to get on fire on some stress <laughs> shit. Probably smoking blades of grass hey, oh and God. shit. Just on some shit like shit. I would be goddamn shit. I'd be trying. I'd be trying to relieve cotton. my mind. I think niggas should have hit though. I think niggas should do more hitting though. I think but niggas, niggas did I get more hitting. I think niggas should have just rebelled on some shit. I would they rather, did though. I would the Gullah War. They don't tell you though about I would, that though. I would rather have heard about these niggas just killing all the white people, bro. And then we just, I don't know, shit just ain't go right on some shit. The niggas. books nowadays and the narrative just make America just seem like just so great. And just, you know, just growing up how the books is. <clears throat> but you don't realize it because you're just trying to get an A though. Niggas in school learning a whole bunch of bullshit. Whole bunch of bullshit. Whole bunch of bullshit, man. I done fucked the video up. That should have been on like it. And it's crazy because everybody, everybody know, people know it's bullshit like that. Their parents know it's bullshit, but they still send their kids there because they find out what the fuck really going on after they leave. Niggas be, nah, niggas be knowing how you get treated if you don't got that education, bro. That's yeah, nigga tweet like a fucking pip school. He ain't got no education. Niggas ain't graduated from high school. Hey, like, nigga tre- feel bad. He get his ass called dumb. Like you get called your ass dumb. Niggas going defense mode. And the nigga got a valid reason to call you dumb. That shit yeah. probably feel so so crazy. He got a valid reason. Like you really dumb, nigga. After the nigga say that, do you got a valid reason to beat his ass though? Cause that shit hurt. That shit probably. <laughs> but hope so it get your ass beat. Or that's gonna be mentally and physically. That shit probably hurt so bad, bro. I ain't gonna cap. What? 
just like being dumb. But yeah. niggas telling you you dumb, and you know you've been thinking every day like, bro, I should have graduated on some shit. Like, bro, I should have did this. I yeah, I'm not saying dumb something. where I'm not saying dumb where you where you actually got like a mental. Nah, I know what you mean. Like, nigga, no, nigga, but nigga sometimes slow. you gotta nigga. say because niggas sensitive about this bitch. Man, I know what you mean. You saying niggas like, sensitive about this bitch? Bro, stupid. Like, but nigga call you stupid though. You think every day like, damn, damn, I'm stupid. Damn, I'm bro, stupid. I should have graduated. I'm so damn stupid, bro. I'm so damn dumb. Yeah, bro. yo, you can't let it get to you. Oh, shit. shit. Ain't you no way you can't to. let it get to you. Nigga, that shit hit you the day you don't graduate. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. When, some, when a nigga say some shit and, and that shit really hit you in in the center of your core, or when you in school getting your ass drawn, it's bad, you know? But you gotta be able to dish it out too, though. I done drawn some niggas out of my lifetime. I ain't gonna cap. I done, I done made niggas cry. I done made niggas cry. Tell the principal type shit. Like, I done, I done drawn niggas so bad they wanted to fight. That shit funny though, it's funny. It, it's 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 two ways to that though. Like it's funny as a what's your name shit, but probably that, that that person probably was on some sad shit. Well, they don't know they just getting joked on just cause it's on some funny shit though. They don't be knowing that shit, so they feel so bad on the inside. Oh, niggas be sad. Yeah, nigga. man. You can't make no nigga. You can't let no nigga make you sad. Bro. Yeah, you can't. You can't let nigga control your emotions. If nigga control your emotion, then they control you. Shit. You might as well just hit a nigga with a jaw. You got it, yeah. bro. You say you got yeah. it, bro. Nigga ain't gonna join you no more, bro. I promise you. For all the niggas who don't know how to join, just go ahead and say, bro, you got it, bro. Or you funny as hell, bro. Nigga ain't gonna keep taking you out because you want some agreeing with him, shit. Or you can, or or, or you can just be open rambunctious. And just laugh at what he's saying loud as fuck and make everybody uncomfortable. But that's some asshole shit. Niggas gonna think you a nerd on some shit out there. Like that's some nerd yeah, shit. Yeah, and then then nigga ain't gonna talk to you no more. You can just be by yourself. You ain't gotta worry about it no more. But then you by yourself though. Shit, watching some movies and TV shows and YouTube videos. So that what happened to you, bro? You got joned out so bad that you just Yeah. That's exactly what happened to me. That ass? <laughs> nah. But I like YouTube videos and movies and TV shows. I was one of them niggas I always had my headphones on and in high school, hood on. Always watching, listening to shit. I joined niggas out. <clears throat> he joined niggas out. I was on some. I wasn't on no real class clown shit. See, Cause I, I ain't used to get in trouble just to get there for niggas to laugh type shit. I was really on some real funny shit. Like niggas get joned out. Niggas, niggas saying funny shit. Teachers get joned like out. cry laughing, like crying laughing, like dead ass running, running away. I used to it's always shit. nice to have that 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 nigga in your class. It's always nice to have a funny. Hey, nigga. how speaking of class, you know your first. You, uh, you remember your first day of Kennesaw here? Like your first day in class here? Yeah, I do remember that shit. Was it was it smooth? No interruption. Like, like you know, like yeah, that did shit you, was straight. Did nigga. you have any interruptions in high school? Like, like did you? I would say for me, like in as high far school as or college, I'm saying like in high school, like did were you able to ever go through with a full class with no interruptions in the class? Yeah, plenty of times. Oh shit, I ain't had that. My first time was like that was all when I got to East Georgia. First class, if it was longer. I just felt oh, like the class was long high as fuck. You yeah. Saying, oh, no interruptions though. Hell yeah, but well, like a teacher school, able to teach nigga the whole time. Ghetto as fuck. It was always an interruption. You know what I'm saying, nigga, nigga, you need to get to college, get a culture shot. Like class feel longer as fuck because ain't nobody because ain't nobody interrupting that bitch. What you interrupting the class that you paid for? Yeah, don't care. You right though. No, you right, but I'm just saying like I'm just saying niggas dumb if they did that. Yeah, don't do that, bro. You stupid. Yeah, don't do that. You and don't, pay two thousand yeah. to interrupt the class, nigga. And, 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 and don't fail. And don't fail unless you paying for neither though. That shit hurt. That shit do hurt. That be the hurt that though. Shit hurt. Knowing you know how to pay for some shit, you got to do it again. Especially if you trying to graduate on some shit. <laughs> that shit hell. No cap though. That school shit was crazy though. Nigga, niggas used to always want to do some crazy shit. I ain't gonna cap. The school was fun though. I ain't gonna lie. High school was too fun. High school, was, was, High school was, was super fun. Yeah, I look back on it. When I was in it, I just wanted to be in this time now where I was doing. Where I can just go. I ain't gonna lie. I was. I just wanted to sell shit when I was in high school. I just wanted to be able just to shit lead a class and just go give me some zappies and eat it, yeah. and then just come back. You know, the, the the simple shit. Niggas used to skip school. Niggas yeah. wasn't even in there. Niggas was passing classes without trying. Really, you know that's what I'm saying. Like niggas, how the hell you niggas got to graduate? How niggas got to graduate? <laughs> how you don't graduate? Niggas wasn't even trying to graduate. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. High school, I I don't remember me doing really no know, work. Yeah. Facts. Shit, no work, no homework. I never did no homework. Man. Yeah. If you sent me home with that shit, that shit was probably either wet, dirty as <laughs> fuck. Like something was wrong with that bitch. The it's next really day to where I couldn't even turn that bitch in no it, more. It's it's crazy. You think about it, how you how you get through. Like just I'm not saying you know I learned shit when I was in high school, but they sent you home with paper though. 
Oh God. You know how much shit can happen with a piece of paper they send you on one piece of paper? One one piece of paper on God. That shit that shit, shit you gotta have a photo. That's why you gotta have a folding book bag for. I ain't gonna lie, how Lisa was done, we couldn't have no book bags. I think eleven twelve grade or some shit. I think nigga I think nigga bought a shot at school and I just ended it. Nigga, I was, had to. I was the type nigga used to have like three three folders, three binders ass nigga. <laughs> Little ass binders though, the cheap ass ones. See, I was I was that nigga that asked folks for paper in class. Me, that's me, cause I knew I had paper at home, but I was on. I don't know. I was on some. Like I know, I know folks in class got it. I know folks in class gonna have it. Yeah, on some shit. Or I had it in my book bag. That's a little girl next to me. Hey, can I get you know two sheets of paper? I ain't used to take my. I ain't used to take my paper out of the bag. I just just cut the top and just get to grabbing that shit. (laughs) (laughs) Quick work. (laughs) Quick work. Hey, did you use a nigga to write on one sheet? Mm-hmm. You just write on one sheet. One sheet. <laughs> nigga ain't using that shit. Hey, that's dangerous. You gotta watch out for them niggas who who just write on one sheet of paper. You ain't gotta write on two sheets of paper, bro. They have some. They have some good. Some some good base under. Nah, nah. But goddamn, I used to put that shit in my my, my folder. Though. <laughs> Hang on, okay. <laughs> I used to put that shit in my. Folder, hey, I walk outside with a paper loose leaf, nigga, blowing shit. I don't think I ever studied for nothing in my life. <laughs> yeah, I ain't studied till I got to to college. It was, it was difficult trying to learn how techniques. To study, but that's that I did it. Dead. That shit always was dead. Nigga had told me I had to go home and learn some <laughs> shit. I did learn at home. I mean, at school, and I got to get up seven a.m. for this shit, and then they stand in my brain. That shit dead. <laughs> it's crazy how they how, how they how did they know? I don't know, cause some folks don't be like that. Some folks actually get up. You know, they want to do their work, and you know they they come to class and do all that. You know, yeah. Um, I don't know how they feel on the inside about doing that shit. I bet them niggas be feeling whack as hell once they graduate. That shit just over. It just yeah, I be you know I want I want I want to talk to a person who was shit. straight. I want to talk to a person mm-hmm. who was straight edge all the way through, and like yeah. just got all straight edge. I just want to know like, how what do you what do you do in your free time? Is it just all work? Like, do you have any personal time? Like, what the fuck is that? Starbucks. God, if I got there, Starbucks coffee. That shit. Library read. That shit sound like a boring ass life. I mean, you living it though. To each his own, but I don't think it's more. I'm finna, I'm finna buy me a book soon, and uh, probably finna read some shit. Fuck around, be balancing some shit. some shit. That guy had a broke, um, like a broken leg on it. Nigga, fuck around, and put the book up on it. No, he buying that bitch for. No, I don't got no. I don't break shit, so uh, I think I'm just gonna, I'm gonna buy like uh, probably some uh, I don't break shit. Some short shit to read. Probably some shit I don't know about. Oh, some diary with the kid type shit. I read diary with the kid already. Yeah, yeah, nigga. Well, I just I I fuck with the movies and shit. You be I fucking w- with movies and shit. I w- I fuck with movies, bro. I watch. Thanks. Yeah, yeah we can go. We, yeah, we 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 can go there. I fuck with I fuck with any any five movies, bro. That shit look fire. I go watch it. What's your favorite movie? Uh, Menace to Society. Yeah, you did say that. I do remember. You. You remember Menace that. to Society. Shit hard, man. I don't think I remember that one, ladies and gentlemen. What Menace to Society? Yeah, it's the one with uh Kane and Old Dog. Uh, that's why you name your your dog Kane. Yeah, your ass funny as fuck. Yeah. I never knew that. Shit, fine. Bro, funny. My favorite movie, Money Talks. <coughs> Money Talks. Yeah, man, Chris yeah, Tucker, man. Bro, funny Chris as fuck, Tuck- man. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. I realized Chris Tucker wasn't that funny. It was just his voice. Yeah, his voice. That, but I'm saying he got a great acting, funny voice. Like he's yeah. perfect in that in that role. Yeah, but that nigga stand up yeah. some cheese. Yeah. I ain't I ain't never watched none none of stand up. Actually, I'm thinking about me doing some stand up. Actually, yeah, shit, man. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Niggas come out trying to crack jokes at me. I'm just gonna. Look I just want to see. I just want to see how it's gonna be. You know, just me at them stage. Yeah. Hopefully, uh, hopefully I get booed off and I can stop. But then I can not do it. Just scratch off the list of doing yeah. shit. That. I couldn't even imagine trying to be a comedian or like trying to actually put shit together that you think niggas gonna laugh at. Mm. So you really just guessing. You just guessing what yeah, you are gonna laugh at. And then if you it's really all about delivery, timing, you know, audience. It's a lot. I ain't gonna count. You got delivery, timing, and all that shit though, and your shit still not funny. It ain't gonna work. Yeah. Also, you gotta know how to uh, relate and relate to people to make them laugh. You know your audience. Don't yeah. care though. Cause I feel like it is a a pocket for everybody as far as being funny, but shit, you may not never come across some people though. No cap. I fuck with all type of humor, unless it's just some cold hearted ass weird shit. I ain't fuck with that. <laughs> but I fuck with like anything that's actually funny though. I fuck with I fuck with the I, I fuck with funny shit that. I fuck with sporadic funny and 
I fuck with bland humor. That shit fam. No bland humor. Cause you just look at it and then you just bust out laughing on some shit. Like Girl, cause you're like, what the did, fuck? He really just did this country ass shit. Yeah. And some folks don't laugh at shit like that. I be wondering like what the fuck wrong with them. That's or cool. maybe they don't their brain just don't Niggas don't you know? know what funny is. If a nigga yeah. can't laugh at a boring show that's doing funny shit. Like you gotta be niggas gotta be. But not head ass though. But not head ass. Not head ass. It's just on. Gotta throw that in there. It's on some shit though. Like niggas don't gotta be loud as fuck just to make you laugh, or just be corny as fuck to make you laugh. Niggas just being doing shit. That shit be funny. But I can't stand on loud ass nigga. Shit, I'm like fifty fifty with DC on fly and on cap. It's probably because he got the uh Chris. Who? What's the nigga name? You you name? Chris Tucker. Chris Tucker voice. He got the Chris. He got the Chris Tucker voice. DC Young, DC Young Fly, DC Young Fly, man, he, he hard though. I was just watching bro music videos, bro doing music, man, R B rap, bro be dancing bro and like, shit, bro do bro it like all. forty though. Mm hmm. Bro like forty though. I think bro in his twenties. Bro not in his twenties at all. He was I in think his, bro is in his twenties. Bro was like twenty eight when we found out about him, bro when he first came out. I got five. He's twenty seven years old. You want to bet some money, bro? Bro getting like crazy. you, you got you got to give me an age too though. I, I think I think bro like probably like thirty one. That's your age, 31? I, like 30. I say 27. I like him to be 34. 34? I'm going with 27. You said 34. I like right? him to be 30, though. Bro, you said nah, nigga. I like him watch to be 30, out. though. He's 28. So watch out, nigga. Bro, look old as fuck. Bro, he, look old as fuck. He don't, though. He like he in his 20s. Bro, look old as fuck, bro. He's 28. Bro, don't look old. Bro. May 2nd, 1992. Have you not seen this nigga, like, his, his Instagram? He, he, old. he don't look old, though. Maybe he just look like an old nigga to me. Yeah, probably. But bro, be making me. Damn, I was time. off though, nigga. Five dollars, you know what I did with five dollars, nigga? I would have got me some fries and some nuggets, nigga. Damn, I ain't ate shit all day. You on that lettuce diet, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> <laughs> Hell no, nah, nigga, just ain't really crazy today. <clears throat> hey man, my lettuce diet, man. Get your banana and apple, man. Every day, man. Help with your digestive system, man. Get you two forms of workout in. Bro created this shit with his own brain power, though. Vegetarian. This, is, this, this ain't no shit he's seen Monday on Monday through Thursday. He created this with his and own brain power. And then we going crazy power. with meat Friday through Sunday. Crazy with meat, though. Pause. Y'all put pause on that, Thank though. You. Thank you, sir. Uh, Nigga geek, man. Man, I ain't I'm eat. Finish this blunt, though. Man, no cap, man. Probably finna get my day destroyed. Cause you say you ain't geek. No. I'm Stone Cold Austin. This nigga said he ain't geek, y'all. You got that. You go on that bit like you singing, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well. Not, man. Niggas, niggas, the, bi- the bitches know. The bitches know I can sing, though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, my nigga, you know, we we rap. I retire rapping. You know, my nigga, he still want to get in there and do some. You know, he still want to make some music. But it's a lot of y'all. This nigga, it's this, a lot of niggas out here just, I feel like this everybody. Nigga retire. This nigga, I fucked, this nigga fucked up the studio, so he retired until he feel like getting another studio, and then and then once that shit hit, he gonna start making some music. I retired, you know what I'm saying? I feel like the type of music I want to make, I don't want to be that nigga. So what? The type of music, the type, <laughs> the of, music type of music I feel like I want to make, make now. I don't even want to be that type of nigga though. What type of music you want to make now, bro? I want some singing, dancing shit, bro. <laughs> Hell nah, bro. Hey, but I don't even want to be see, bro. see, but at least I know who I am. I'm not gonna go do that. Some niggas would go do that. Like, imagine me trying to, you know, I, you and I can. Though, bro. You say singing and dancing. I can sing and dance. Type shit. Yeah, I feel like you know. I want a talent show figure eight for doing the Michael Jackson. You know, I got that in my blood. Like, I can dance, but you know, I, I gotta know. chill sometimes. I do. Some of that shit, that shit just ain't life. Being <laughs> weird like that, that shit ain't even life. Niggas shouldn't be that weird. I ain't, I ain't on no hey, weird I shit. Fuck. I don't I think fuck. I got no weird shit going on about me ever. But bro, right here, the host, his show, host it's a weird nigga, the man. Most the weird niggas are interesting. Keep I appreciate. Watching, keep watching this nigga. I appreciate. You know, he's probably like three hundred fifty seventh nigga that called me weird. I appreciate that. I've been keeping track. Oh, I had one for every year until you came here. Face that. Hey, yeah, that. Oh my god, I think someone every year, one for every day. I feel like long self up, man. Like nigga, 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 had many days. <clears throat> what, what, uh, what a lighter at Hey What we gotta talk about is y- Y'all niggas out here bro Y'all niggas gotta stop Stop stealing niggas lighters bro See one This my lighter This black lighter my lighter Oh yeah I st- I'm I'm the nigga that take a lighter in the session I ain't gonna lie hey, this I'm black gonna let lighter niggas know lighter. what it is hey, And then I don't even know what a lighter I, j- I just gave him 
And we in the he session. Passed me, he passed me his other yeah, lighter. So I, I passed can, him my lighter so he can give it so back to me. So he can give me. it back to me. Look, he can though, have see, both of them. See, that he, shit hell. I, I be hanging around, bro, so you kind of know, like, you know, my, you know, my chicken shit. I got to come with, with, some, with some new shit. But, uh. That shit fucked up. No, nah, but if if a nigga just leave the lighter down, like, somewhere, and he don't claim it, I'm not just finna be that. I'm not gonna be that nigga that's gonna be like, yo, who lighter this is? You know, that ain't me. But I'm not, I don't consider that stealing because I hate, I hate niggas that steal. If I don't know who dropped it, if I don't know who lighter it is, genuinely, I'm not gonna act. I just went into detail about taking lighters and shit, but I'm glad you stopped me if I got on the road. This nigga stole two of my lighters in front of y'all niggas. Whoa, the, the black one yours? Niggas and stole. I don't got no lighter. Niggas stole my lighter. I stole that black one from Quay. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of Quay, man, we got we gonna have Quay on Thursday, man. Hey, cut this part out though. I don't want him looking for his lighter. I left it down in the living room for like. I don't know. This shit raw. Shit raw. Real conversation. This shit. All this shit gonna get taken hey. off. Shit, I ain't mean. got your lighter. That shit was just a joke, bro. <laughs> Look, they gotta they gotta take it back. You, don't need, you don't need that lighter though. I'm pretty sure you done bought you a lighter since then. Man, I'm planning on I, I'm on the Tinder right now. My talking conversation got a Tinder, and uh, I'm you know I'm trying to find you know hopefully I can find a a, a nice lady to talk to, you know, pick their brain. You know I want to just have all males on this bitch. The mic smoking. That shit crazy. I think it'd be nice you know to throw the genders around shit like that, and, you know all <laughs> walks of life. Man. It should be on weird shit. So, you get a bitch off Tinder, bro. That bitch gonna be on some weird shit. <laughs> For real. Kind of weird shit. <coughs> it depends on what race of, race of bitch it is, though, too. You get a Mexican bitch, she might fuck around in the country. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> you get you a white bitch on this bitch, she might fucking talk your head off. She might be on some weird crack shit, too. Like, yeah, I, yeah, did, I, I, I want, did ask before. I want one of them guests that, that does most talking just so I can sit back and see what the fuck they talking about. Oh, you need a nigga who talk too much. Go get now. Got down. Who talk too much though? Like real, real. We we'll keep talking the whole yeah, time. Yeah, I'm. I don't know. I really, I don't know how I'm gonna choose who was going to be just because I don't know none of them. So it was just like kind of weird. But uh, hi. Would you like to be on my podcast? Yeah. Just to start off, no. Just start off though. I want to have you know just my niggas on here. Don't just bring some, a white bitch in here, bro. Just some um. <laughs> I might sleep her. I might sleep her if she. I was just playing. I was. Just, <laughs> That's a what the fuck bro was doing on the YouTube, oh god. <laughs> you can talk about that shit too. I'm oh a god. sleeper. <laughs> so I've been not walking my hallway, man, and see no white bitch back of a white bitch head. Man, we, what, the, what the fuck you doing? I don't have the same feelings I'm towards lying. white, white, I, bi- white bitches. I'm like lying, me. bro. I fuck with white females. <laughs> Cause it'll be it'll just be just out of the ordinary. Yeah, it, it it would be it would be some it would be different. It would be different. Should get slow though. I like different though. I wouldn't hit no female either though. Just because I I, I ain't gonna lie. I do I do wish I I could invent a gender changing machine for fifteen seconds. I always said this. Um, you know, just a quick thing. You know, niggas could jump in real quick. Bada bop, change to a bitch. Same height, same weight, same strength, everything, same length, and you're just able to fight. You know, whoever. Whoever you want for a minute, you know, because some bitches do. I feel like some, some, I don't want to say bitches, but some, yeah, I'm gonna say bitches regardless. I don't give a fuck, but uh, some, uh, some females actually be, uh, I feel like they talk crazy because they know, um, that if a male hits them, like the type of response in society that gets, but with this gender transformation machine, all that's off the table. Now I am a 6'3 female, just like you, ma'am, and, and we got a hit. Six three. Come on, man. Let me have it. Six three. Let me have it. <laughs> I put that bitch on my license. Let me have it. Six three female though. Yeah, imagine that though. Six three female. I'm long too. My arms, my arms go past my knees, so I got Six, some reach. Three female. Where the fuck you finding them at? It's something in the WNBA. Scared on. Don't need them. A bit too tall. Somebody, somebody tell Brittany Griner let me play her one on one. Brittany Griner? Yeah, we can play Would two dribbles. You play dribble. Maya Moore one on one though. I play Maya Moore two dribbles from the uh, three dribble from Maya the elbow. Give a three. 
Huh? I don't give her three so she can mix. No, we doing two. She Maya Moore. We can do two. We can get some bag in. Why she can't do three. Maya. It's female though. My name is Richard. We can get some bag work in me and you. We can go elbow two dribbles. Uh, you know. My money on Maya. Hey, everybody put their money on Maya. Everybody put ten in the pot. I like that. Ten bands, cause I know Maya is gonna cook some. Uh, and I don't discriminate. See, some niggas when they play females, they may be like, "Oh, she a female." I don't give a fuck. I'm playing, cause you out here too, and I want to show you that same respect that you would show me. I feel like niggas who don't who don't play females like they would a male. That's weird. I'm being that shit. And I'm, God, I'm like I'm slapping that shit. Like, I've been one. I've been one to block somebody. Fun. It's like playing. I've been one to block somebody's shit anyway today. I'm saying. So why not just block her shit? Yeah, fuck it. I don't fuck. Fuck you know, how I, niggas feel about it too. I, and <laughs> so I hate. And I hate. Feelings. You know. And if she out there, she can probably hoop. And if she score, I'm gonna you be mad. Me? And niggas be in their feelings too. Y'all niggas gotta chill. Yeah, you, why you niggas getting, be in their feelings? Getting, you getting your? Let's fi- speak on that. Why getting, niggas be in their feelings? Well, let's not. Let's not leave this topic though. If a bitch, get, I mean, if a female, cause we on the court, so she a female. We ain't yeah. calling her no bitch. We ain't calling no bitch. Shit, if a female come in the paint, I beat her shit, bro. I slap that shit out of bounds. <laughs> Why is a nigga mad Because I play her for real bro Why is a nigga oh, mad God, It be niggas that let her lay the ball up And and, and, and now and now we down 7-6 You feel me I don't give a why, fuck Why nigga mad Don't get in your feelings bro You getting your feelings Is not finna let a female Like it's not gonna make a female Like you bro A lot of y'all <laughs> niggas Gotta start meditating And start being in control Of y'all self man a lot, of, like, a lot of niggas like Letting other niggas Get them out of they Out of they spear Out of they How they supposed to be acting You the main get nigga Get niggas mad You the main nigga Getting niggas mad though See, I see niggas. I, I'm able. No, I just do it to niggas who, who I feel like. I don't know. Niggas are just ain't not for nothing to talk to me crazy. I just feel like, you know. Niggas be wanting to go back and forth about basketball. Yeah, for no reason. Niggas ain't going back and forth about and basketball. Then, and then, and then, and then, and then, be trying to hit. Then be trying to hit niggas. No, nobody ever be trying to hit. Like, what's up? Can never. we hit? You be saying, niggas, niggas actually ask a nigga every day. Is they trying to hit? And no nigga don't never want to hit. It's either me, him, Quay, somebody. It's somebody just asking a nigga, do they want to hit, bro? Even TJ, bro. I'm a I'm a forewarn niggas. I'm a forewarn niggas. <laughs> forewarn. I just I'm not no regular nigga. Like I'm not just finna hit with my hands. I might run house kicking your <coughs> temple and knock you out, nigga. I'm sleeping niggas. And bro, sleeping niggas with, with with the haymaker. I'm sleeping niggas. <laughs> oh God, bro, coming. Bro, I'll probably throw all bro, come, niggas bro, fight I'm in. I ain't gonna. <laughs> bro, coming clean up through. Sl- I might just come and try to just send a nigga, send a nigga to the flow, bro. I don't know, man. I'm, you know, I'm trying to, I'm trying to start this UFC thing up, man. Well, actually, well, really, I feel like now it's perfect just because I'm not a fat piece of shit anymore. I feel like I was a, pat- a fat piece of shit last year. Uh, now I feel like I'm. You know, I unlock my hips and you know, my core. That's Ethiopian shit. Yeah. I don't know what the fuck that meant, but, uh, <laughs> you know, I'm feeling light, you know, lettuce like. So I feel like, you know, I'm able to flow. So I feel like, man, now is the perfect time. Yeah, man. But niggas do be in their feelings, though. I'm gonna get back to that topic, though. Yeah. Niggas, niggas gotta chill, bro. Every every day, another nigga get into an argument, another nigga crying about a bitch, another nigga doing something. Man, y'all niggas supposed to come together as niggas. Yeah, man. And be like, man, fuck that bitch. You gotta understand. You gotta understand what it is. Like, just knowing you can't control nobody else. So you really get mad at somebody else for doing something. Like once you understand that, you will put yourself at ease and relief, and and just knowing like you can't control. What nobody else doing but yourself. Only way I have to, only way I have to fucking like hit with a nigga, kill a nigga about a bitch, is if he fucked up in my house, bro, on my bed, and I ran into this shit and I seen this shit with my own eyes. Oh, that's invasion, man. Yeah, that's just that's me. that's that, uh, and that's a free body though. That's uh, me just killing. That was a criminal like, justice major. I forgot that. That's a law. That's something you can. Yeah, you can go off and brush shit. No, I could kill, bro. He's in my home. That's what I mean. You can go off and brush shit. Nah, whatever, whatever. Well, other ways, you know? your preference of going off and brush shit. That's I'm your. Like, <laughs> <laughs> hey, how I'm feeling now, I might shoot, bro, then sleep him. <laughs> <laughs> how I'm feeling right now, bro. Hey, imagine they get shot, then get, get punched. punched. Nigga, Hard what, as nigga? fuck, though. Hard and, as fuck. Nobody's and, stressing And, bro, butt-ass naked, too, though. Worst way to die. 
Nah, you ain't got nothing covered. Imagine you trying to shield butt ass nigga ain't got no clothes protecting you. Already got popped. That's you crazy. Trying to shield your body because that's you crazy say. how this little shirt protect me from like just you know, I don't know if I ran into like a wall or something. I'm not gonna really feel the impact as if I had my shirt off though. That's crazy. It's Same mindset. Same mindset. Same mindset, bro. Same impact, bro. Same amount of power. Shirt didn't absorb anything. Shirt didn't absorb anything. <laughs> <laughs> You over here talking about shirts absorbing impacts, bro. Shit not happening, bro. It's just a mindset, bro. Only thing, only difference is skin not clapping against some shit. That's just, that's really the only difference. <laughs> it's only different, bro. Shit feel the same. I beg a different. I don't now, know. shoes, shoes are different. They are thick. You talk about a cloth, a cloth absorbing impact. No, you fall I don't from, know. Hey, you jump from a skyscraper and you got on about three of that's them different. hanes, three of them hanes, motherfuckers. Then I see you. That's <laughs> Maybe, different. Oh, you'll survive. That's different though. Let me stack three hands on. I can I, do this. I don't, shit, you can have on a fucking bubble, nigga, and still feel that one. Bubble gonna pop. God, bubble nigga, gonna bubble pop. jacket pop. You know, nigga, landing. <laughs> and, they, and they say, they say if you drop a penny from the, from a skyscraper, they cut a nigga in half, bro. Why they? Say <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Why they say that? Hell no, nah, that be nah, that shit, that shit, They say that shit would like cut through a nigga head, skull though. I don't, I don't know. I, I think it'll change the trajectory. It might fucking land on the. On like the the flat part, I don't think he'll do that. That's on some movie shit. Baby, look it up though; it's real. Just cause I know how wind work, I'm not even gonna look that up. <clears throat> I'm telling you, it's real. Learn this shit. Where you seen this at? Twitter? Nah, somebody told me this though, but not. It was on a regular person. It had to be like a teacher or some shit. Don't even look it up right now, bro. Don't try to put me on the spot. Look it up. Like no, no, I'm geek, man. Let them look it up. I'm geek, man. For real though. Oh, uh, bro, I was gonna take my cap out the wall. You know, cap on this bitch. Hey man. And for all y'all niggas like chasing that music shit, bro. Nah, matter of fact, for all y'all niggas who cool the nigga who chasing that music shit, bro. Fish your ass, bro. Just tell them to stop, bro. It's getting lame. It's getting lame at this point. Cause I see I see niggas with real talent, bro, and I see niggas who really just sound terrible, bro. And it's everywhere. It's you know you just gotta be realistic, man. It's okay, it's okay. Cause at the end of the day, like you just gotta be real with your nigga. Like if that shit not hard, don't tell him that shit hard. But maybe maybe it is hard to them know. But then it's just like no, it's not. You gotta stop that. Stop that trying to be nice shit. You know you gotta be realistic, man. What I say, man? Some shit is out here hard, you know. Post that, post that, you know. Like when a nigga dropping some shit, in my partners, bro. If I can hear his sound, bro, and I fuck with it myself, then I see like, oh yeah, other niggas will fuck with that shit. Then I fuck with it. I'm gonna tell him like he fire. But if a nigga not fire, bro, I'm gonna tell him like, bro, you gotta chill. Or that song not fire, I'm just gonna be like, bro, that shit just not fire. That shit ass. I don't fuck with that. One. Like, yeah, you gotta just learn how to take. Some nigga gotta learn how to just take that and be like. Some niggas be like, what the fuck, nigga? Hey. Niggas do say you hang. But they want you to tell them that, though. But they they, they still going to say you hang. So just go ahead and just let him feel like you hang on him. And but you was being said. a good friend, though. Yeah, a lot of folks. Yeah. You got to know you gotta know who you is and what you doing at the end of the day. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? A real friend ain't going to stop being yeah, cool with over that shit. <clears throat> you know, cat, though. I think I might go to Taco Mac tonight. All right, I need to reward myself for this long ass day. She getting from there? Shit, yeah, I'm probably finna go. I always do that the cafe was open, man. I tell you, man, they got my love. Oh, I'm finna go to Nigga the Diner, bro. I can't do that. I'm one. driving. I can't do that. I'm, I'm driving. I wanna do that one, but I can't do that one. I'm driving. I need that. Fish. Oh, it is Monday. Fish. Need that. It sure is Monday. Fish. Should have called it in, huh? I'm sitting down. I'm in. <laughs> I'm sitting down and I'm eating that shit. Enjoying that shit. Well, I might go to Applebee's. Nah, that shit over with. Hey. Applebee's. Shit, I'm just finna start. <clears throat> hey, we just gonna have to re- just sit here and just have to rate and some like, restaurants yeah. real quick. Because Applebee's, three out of ten. This nigga go here too often, though. But Applebee's to me, you know. Seven. No, I'm gonna give. I'm, 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 I'm go gonna go six. Give it, go for real. I'm gonna go six. I'm gonna go six. Let's be real with everybody, bro. I'm gonna be six. You give it like a nine. No, I'm gonna be six. No, I'm gonna be realistic right now. 
You know, I fuck with Taco Mac would be an eight. Um, Taco Mac probably is like a six and a half. It's good. And what's the eight to you then? I don't know, bro. You gotta give me. You gotta like call some shit out, and I'll be like, "Yeah, that motherfucker." Hey. GK Patty. I ain't, I've never been to the GK yeah, Patty, but I have Roof Chris. A lot of bad reviews. Roof Chris. I ain't never been to Roof Chris either. Surprisingly, yeah, me neither. surprisingly, uh, sure. I don't go to all that bullshit because I don't. I don't need all that. I'm good. <laughs> nah, but I have been to like. <laughs> ain't got no tennis fries, nigga. No, <laughs> nigga, add me. Oh God, nigga, niggas go to uh, thousand dollar <laughs> restaurants. And go buy tennis and fries. Y'all niggas need to chill. Y'all niggas need to chill the fuck. Hey, out. no, but they should Try be. Shit, bro. But they should be lightly breaded live, though. On live. some ass, I hate lightly breaded. Live, live, live a little, live, live a little. See, I'm a nigga. I don't like trying. I don't like trying new shit. You know, because I feel like I know what I like, and if I like it, I know it's gonna satisfy me. So what? What else we asking? I'm just saying, you gotta try some shit, bro. You gotta, you gotta mix it up, bro. Hang on. I feel like niggas who mix it up don't really ever. Don't ever get into the obsession stage. Uh, uh, niggas have ups. Niggas have obsessions, bro. I'm I'm obsessed with cereal. I bro, obsessed cereal. with cereal. You are too. I'm bro. obsessed with French fries. You obsessed with cereal too, though. I'm obsessed with Every cereal. Every nigga, I haven't had cereal. I haven't. I haven't had cereal. <laughs> <laughs> Cat me down. Cat me down. I'll wait. Uh, I ain't had cereal in like two weeks though. But when I do get cereal, you know, shit, we get it in. Yeah, we get to live in. live off it. Of, Cereal, yeah, we can. Live you can really it. live off cereal, you know. I stopped eating cereal because I thought it was bad for niggas you, but lucky. then again, niggas lucky I ain't got no milk. Yeah, man. <laughs> a lot of folks out here, niggas lucky, can't. <laughs> a lot of folks lactose intolerant. I feel sorry for y'all. Niggas stink. <laughs> <laughs> niggas stink lactose intolerant. You farting and shit just because you can't. You enjoy the bowl of cereal. Oh God, stink. stomach fuck fuck can't up. I wonder nothing. what is that though. Can't Damn. have nothing though. Can't and I wonder. Cheese. When they happen. found out, like whenever they found out, was it a bad experience from that from the finding out? Niggas eat straight macaroni and grease. Can't eat cheese. <laughs> Just eat macaroni. Niggas boiling macaroni and eating it like that. As long as I can eat French fries, I can do any any diet. As long as French fries this, are a part of it. This nigga don't eat cheese. I, I eat I eat pizza. But I never had mac and cheese before. I never had a cheeseburger. Uh like this like this video and subscribe if he tripping. <laughs> Please do that. But if you don't, shit, then I know I ain't tripping. So he tripping. I he hundred percent tripping. Like this shit and subscribe. I do. I do see. That. I, I, you know, mac and cheese do do look like it would be appetizing to other people though. So I can't say that. Yo, yeah, tripping. That shit fine. You need to be got down. Go ahead and you know, give my, it a chance. My Thanksgiving plate look, look, look real bland. Dry. You know? Dry. Ham, cornbread, and collard greens. That's it. Nigga eat straight turkey. I don't even eat turkey nigga. nigga eat straight turkey leg Turkey be dry Turkey leg <laughs> Turkey dry as fuck I like ham That's why I said plate dry You like yeah I eat stuff you know I don't Macaroni and cheese my plate That's it But you eat straight macaroni, macaroni and that. Straight macaroni <laughs> I'm there for the macaroni and cheese And I can have it any time though But I'm there for it <clears throat> I need macaroni and cheese I need um Chicken Should we got fried chicken in that bit I eat some fried chicken Pizza hard I fuck with the pizza though. We talking about Thanksgiving nigga <laughs> I always I, I want to do a different edition for Thanksgiving though, and have other foods and you know, like have a seafood thing. Nah, niggas have. Oh yeah, we you had seafood. We had a seafood. You go for that? Oh, we you had, had that Thanksgiving. That shit man. tough. How that shit was? Hardcore. Let me get let me get an explanation. Like what y'all had? Everything. Damn oysters, all that shit. Shit was hard. I didn't eat. I don't eat that shit. Yeah, but but, you you know, but, but you know, just having it there on some shit, just shit seafood up. They was cooking that shit like I don't even fucking know. They were cooking that shit forever though. I know that much, and that shit was hard. I bet though seafood do take a lot to cook. That shit was too. That hard. shit hard. I want to have a seafood. You no, know I want to. I want to get. I want to get together with some friends. I don't know. I always wanted a a, a, a fat ass. Niggas had shrimp. I always wanted a, a friend group on some movie shit. Movie shit. Yeah, movie a, a movie group friend type shit on some movie shit. Movie group friend. Yeah, whatever that meant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro. For real, niggas geeking this bitch. Yeah. No. Oh yeah, we were supposed to really be rating the um the restaurants and shit though. I like Burger King. I used to like Burger King. Zero. Hey, bro, don't fuck with Burger King. Nobody fucks with Burger King. If you don't fuck with Burger King, like and subscribe to this video. If uh -huh. you already like and subscribe, cause he was tripping earlier, go get on your other one and like and subscribe to this video. <laughs>
Because <laughs> Brett is tripping. Brett is tripping. Comment I used to like Burger King. You know, I used to get me, you know, double Whopper, you know, fries. They fries are decent because uh, they just fries. But they ain't, they, ain't, they ain't the best thing in the world, though. I like Dairy Queen fries. You know, I don't think nobody out here in the world love French fries. A Dairy Queen is like uh, me. On a fast food scale, probably like seven out of ten. You fuck with Dairy Queen? Yeah, yeah Dairy yeah. Queen hard. It's like, it's, I don't know. They shit be hard. Sonic? You, fast food scale? Oh, shit. I ain't ten had out Sonic. Of, ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. I ain't had Sonic in a minute, though. Ten out of ten. Like, yeah, I, I, I agree. I can't though. lie to nobody. I, I agree. When I talk about Sonic, I agree with that one. But well, now we gonna get real passionate though on some archaic shit. Let's do it. Let's do it. Sonic, bro. That shit talking about something, bro. It is. Everything I ever had from Sonic has been fire. Nigga, I went there. I only eat chili, nigga. On on hot dogs, nigga. Chili dogs, nigga. I ain't never even tried no chili dog, nigga. I ate that shit there. That shit was different. I went to Varsity. One out of ten, by the way. One out of ten Cause it is better varsity downtown it, is, it is better Better than Burger King So The varsity You talking about The varsity downtown Yeah I, they, I, Nan I had them As like a small child I don't think nan. I remember I don't think my taste I don't think my taste Will remember like Nan What the fuck They were talking about Ain't talking about Nan Nan At all Talking about nigga Talking about being Chick-fil-A man, tonight Talking about being sick Chick-fil-A Please Can I have a sponsorship I eat y'all food All the time anyway. Chick-fil-A probably Like a 9 out of 10 Chick Fil A ten out of ten for me. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. I get, I get, I get these modes I where it's it. crazy. It's crazy. What they do, like how they have you think about them, is really crazy. Yeah, niggas be thinking about Chick Fil A on Sunday all the time. And not even just on Sunday though. It be crazy. Now be watering like it's crazy. That shit too crazy. Brainwashing. They brainwashing niggas with yeah, this yeah. shit. They yeah, probably everywhere. got some. I, w- I want to have a Chick Fil A employee on here and see like what they put in. <clears throat> and they hear you with the my pleasure. So you getting treated good every time you go why there. Everybody why everybody start saying? Why everybody start saying about players? You like saying because they know there's some brainwashing. Shit, on some bro. shit though, they don't get y'all. They know some brainwash. Bro, think about it, bro. Why won't you go somewhere where a nigga treat you good every time you go? You say what? Why wouldn't you go somewhere where the niggas treat yeah, you good okay, every time though, you go? Why wouldn't you go somewhere where, where you know you are gonna get great the great service? Great they ain't service. F- they ain't fucking up no meals and none of that shit. They just I never never had a fucked up meal. I always got everything. I ain't gonna lie. Bag. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all niggas be holding me on the large fries. Don't let y'all niggas know that. Y'all niggas be holding me on large fry though. Nah, like niggas, they, stop they be that. tripping. I don't know what they be on, bro. They're like they don't fill it all the way up. Like what the fuck? It's what a you large. What you got all this space for? But you just still give me a medium and a large basket. It's like the Lay's bag of chips they got nowadays. You know, it should be fat. That shit's sad. It is. Hey, how the hell? <laughs> hey, Lay's, y'all watching this? Give me a sponsorship. <laughs> how the fuck y'all niggas putting air? How y'all niggas putting air? How y'all niggas putting more air in the bag than chip? How the fuck y'all doing that, nigga? Y'all selling <laughs> balloons. Oh God! Sick. You open that bitch. You dip your hand. Yo, my whole elbow was in the family side bag trying to get the chips out. So much air in that bitch. You pop that bitch open. So much air come out, nigga. You got a burp. That shit gonna <laughs> even know. <laughs> I fuck out. with laid classes though. Most folks fuck them fuck with laid classes. I eat, I, I eat them some them. oily ass chips. I'm just a basic nigga. That's that sound like I, me just saying that sound pretty basic. I fuck with um. I don't even. Really, I fuck with flames. I don't even like onions though. But I fuck with Fiends Yeah Fiends hard Only time I eat onions McDonald's McDonald's You, you eat McDonald's Hey Hey we gonna We gonna be 100% real though You gotta We gotta stop eating Fast food McDonald's general. You gotta stop eating McDonald's though Yeah we gotta stop but eating But I ain't McDonald's. gonna cap Taste I don't know what That shit don't even That shit ain't talking about Nothing though But it's like 10 out of 10 They nuggets not real chicken 10 out of 10 I don't know what the fuck They doing bro They nuggets not real but chicken But that shit got a taste on it that shit good. They nuggets are not real chicken. I just get the little, little, little cheeseburger. I repeat, their nuggets get a regular are not real cheeseburger. No, not that serious. Y'all niggas getting Big Macs and shit. I don't know what that's doing for y'all. That shit probably be five. I believe it's five. Everything I get from that five McGrill. Yeah, I be doing DoorDash. Supposed to get for real, get Big Macs and large sodas. Like yeah. that's a real thing. Like are y'all niggas serious? I eat McGriddles, bro. Y'all gotta stop, stop it. Oh, eating Taco Bell and shit, and, and so what you rate Taco Bell and watching that? What you rate McDonald's? I don't eat Mexican food, so I, I can't rate, rate Taco Bell. That's not that's not what'd Mexican you, food. I probably, I probably offended some Mexican, but it's not Mexican food, but just like the tacos and shit. <laughs> McDonald's though. <laughs> Say what? what was McDonald's? What you rate it? Uh, back in the day, I feel like now it just everybody eating it, so I don't think the food is as good. But back in the day, it probably would have been a seven, but now McDonald's that seven. shit a two. Even they fries. Just me, just <laughs> me knowing, oh God, just me knowing, like that shit, that shit not talking about nothing for real. So he's eating my something though. 
For real. Every, hey, Nick Riddle. I'm a sweet tea advocate. You, you actually tripping, but. I never had a breakfast before. McDonald's man. hard. I never yeah. had a breakfast. Never had but a McGriddle. And, and it's not and it's not amazing, but it's hard as fuck. Bojangles hard. No. Hey man, sh- hey no. Bojangles. I done spent so much. No, I work no for jangles. y'all. Bojangles, I work for y'all at the airport. No hey, y'all niggas, my hard work. Waking up. That's why. That's why you think he's good because he was brainwashed there when he was eating. He nigga, just, hard he work. Was eating, nigga. He was eating on break. He was I taking like it home. Grown, he was smelling it. He was frying that shit. Grown man, it up. forty hours a week. He was living. Bojangles at he the was. Li- he was living. Bojangles. He was living. Bojangles. I was getting it in. Think about it, y'all. Though. I was. Nigga it's got bo-time. brainwashed, so now he only it's fuck with Bojangles. I know it's both. Bojangles is terrible. Think about how much you got. Bojangles better than Popeyes. No. Bojangles better than Popeyes. And I said it, nigga. Yeah. I'm gonna ignore it. I ain't gonna argue with you about no Popeyes because we know that shit ain't true. Bojangles make a chicken sandwich. Niggas are gonna start dying more than the. You know they fry their chicken in, in, in Cajun. Who? Bojangles. Who cares? It's Bojangles, nigga. <laughs> Keep that shit away. Who cares, nigga? Fucking Bojangles. Listen <laughs> to the name. That shit don't make you want to buy shit. Bojangles. <laughs> you like some Bojangles? Oh God, Popeyes! But nigga niggas say I got some Popeyes, Louisiana, <laughs> Louisiana <laughs> rub, Louisiana fast, nigga. You gonna what? Say damn, Popeyes, nigga, eyes gonna pop. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, eyes gonna pop. Oh God, nigga, eyes gonna pop out. Popeyes, for real though, that shit real. It's advertisement shit is very real, Popeyes, man. Popeyes, Popeyes, too bad. That shit, they chicken be, oh, they shit crazy as fuck. And that's that, good though, bro. That yeah. advertisement shit too real. That shit crazy. Yeah. Like all the shit we just talking about, that shit just all advertisement though. They just yeah brainwashing niggas. They do yeah, just pushing on our face and shit. And we go there. I mean shit. But you don't see commercials about the places like Taco. You don't see a Taco Mac commercial. I know. Chick Fil A just made a commercial. I feel like recently. I have seen a Taco Mac commercial. Um, Buffalo Wild Wings too. Yeah, Buffalo Buffalo Wild Wings, man. Well, not nasty, but they. They wings fat Five as fuck. Out of 10. Then they, then they, they fries little as fuck. Five out of ten. Little ass fries, shrimp ass fries. Hey. McDonald's fries, ten out of ten. Best fries. I like to get no salt on my fries. Bread is bread like potato. Yeah, the salt just make it. It's just sometimes niggas don't niggas don't know what too much salt it is. Man, I'm probably finna got down go to McDonald's after this shit. I ain't gonna cap. Hmm. Niggas was talking about. Uh, um, your body gonna be very though. upset with upset upset with you in a few years. <laughs> Damn, that fucked up. <laughs> McDonald's shit, McDonald's gonna get you fucked up. It ain't me. <laughs> no need some fried rice. You eat straight fries, bro. Your skin is turning the color of a French fry. You, I do. I ain't gonna lie. My, I do got the color of my skin is French fry. Like, <laughs> he don't think nothing of it though. He think that's his regular skin color. His pops dark I'm probably skin. probably turning. My pops not dark skin. You know? His brother dark skin. My brother not Every, dark skin. Everybody dark skin. Hell so no. Nah. This, <laughs> this nigga turning into. Oh fries. god! What if I had a? What if you met my my family? I don't think we're all dark skin. I'm saying you turning into some fry. You wouldn't even know that you think he was on some regular shit. How much you eat them hoes? I'm probably gonna turn into a French fry. Yeah. Yeah, yo, ass go out bad. Probably gonna got down. Turn to some shrimp. I ain't gonna care. I'm probably turn to a big ass shrimp. Eat that shit. Can't eat too much seafood though. Why not? Cause it's some like too much mercury in it. You can't eat too much seafood. Like what's new? You gotta wait a couple days. Ain't too much of. I ain't gonna cap. Shit too far. Fuck it. Shit too far. I ain't gonna cap. Seafood is the hardest food. The hardest genre of food. You know what I'm saying? You know when I went to Louisiana. You know what I'm saying? That uh, full of trip. They had some fire ass shrimp. I really just want to travel the world and eat fat ass foods and let myself go, but that ain't the right cheese, way. Brad cheese, so everywhere he go, it's going to be a fun I'll just get the same way. I'll just yeah. get the same thing everywhere I go. I'll be satisfied with that. Nigga get chicken tender in Paris. <laughs> Nigga what? Nigga going to be in Paris ordering chicken tenders and fries. Oh, no. If I was in Paris, I'll get boneless, some wings. Boneless. Nah, another, another one. Another thing that I have to say to these niggas. No way you should be 6'5". 2 20 eating six piece bonus wing, man. You gotta stop doing that to yourself. Yeah, there's some niggas out here eating six piece bonus. Six five, though. These niggas tall, man. These niggas big as fuck, man. These niggas eating six piece bonus wings. Not them stop. Nah, I've yeah. got a six piece with my shit been bone in, though. Shit gonna kill you, bro. You keep eating like that. <laughs> niggas gonna starve, man. You swole the hell eating like that, bro. It probably is trying to lose weight. 
Why are you swole trying to lose weight? <laughs> How does that look? <laughs> How does that look? <laughs> <laughs> Shit, I don't know. Probably be ripped as fuck. What? <laughs> oh, you get more ripped. Yeah, since you swole. You, you already was already swole. swole, though. That shit, rip got to be smaller than swole. Think about that shit. A nigga can be swole in. A rip, rip nigga is like, nigga can be skinny like you, but have muscle on him. Like, it's tone. That's a rip nigga. That's tone, though. That ain't swole rip. nigga is a nigga who rip and bo- tone the same thing? Whose body mass is big because his muscles are big. That's rip a swole it. nigga. Rip and tone the same thing? Tone is, tone, yeah, basically. That shit basically the same thing, bro. Niggas, it should not different. A rip nigga would be a nigga that you see like he got some muscle. Like tone nigga, just you see a little dents and shit on his body type shit. <laughs> All right, you see nigga. a little something. Yeah, a nigga be swollen and ripped. So my nigga lose that swollen, he just be. Nah, be ripped. I don't think you can lose that shit like that though. Thank you. <laughs> you probably could though. Yeah, yeah, you could though, cause muscle is just you just swelling your body up on some. Yeah, people shit. gotta take care of their bodies, man. It's a lot of fat folks out here. You gotta call it what it is. Yeah, I was watching um. Thousand pound sisters I don't even know How that's a real thing Yeah that's not healthy man That's crazy And they be thinking that They be cheating Their own diets and shit Like they'll put them On a diet They be cheating that shit That shit crazy How you But then Do you just Or What if they're just okay With just being that big And just eating Cause I, I felt like I've I've thought about that Heavily like me just eating And just Not giving a fuck About nothing Just eat I ain't never thought Like that though I have I think about it often actually it's probably because you be starving yourself. Six piece bones. I don't starve myself, guys. Six piece bones. You make, bro, bro, you make it seem like I just, I'm living a, a fucking savage, savage lifestyle. Like, I don't eat, nah, I just be work. Eating, you'll be eating <laughs> anything if you don't savage shit. You don't, bro. You want some of me, but shit. <laughs> <laughs> you want some of me, but shit. You don't need too much to survive shit. Like, you trying to prove to yourself, I don't need that. <laughs> I don't need what I want. The fuck? I don't. I have these wants for no reason. Like yeah, that's what you on. I feel like people do that niggas crack no one reason. egg in the morning. I, mean, I do two eggs, man. Little grits, man. Little turkey bacon. Niggas crack one egg in the morning. Maybe two. Sometimes three when I'm feeling like a big dog. Niggas eat straight eggs. No uh-huh. cheese. No cheese. Yeah, just some people pepper. out there. No cheese. I want do, do do y'all put cayenne pepper on y'all eggs? I put salt and pepper. And I, I go I go cayenne on top. Niggas do salt and pepper. I go cayenne cheese, on top. But the cheese already there though, so the cheese got flavor. We don't need cayenne. It's too much flavor. No, nah, but you gotta learn. You can't put too much. You never put too much season. I used you can't to put my, too much season. Shit, will fucking around and kill you. I used to over season my chicken. I'm talking shit be hella salty. Nah, over season chicken though. That shit hard. It is chicken hard. I ain't gonna lie, chicken the hardest meat. Not not ba- not the shit that's under season. That's chicken might be better than seafood. Chicken fire. Chicken is fire. Chicken, as fuck. chicken is not better than shrimp. You right though. It's really the bread. It ain't it's even not, shrimp. It's not better than it ain't even the shrimp. It's, it's the bread. It's the it's the shrimp. It's who making it too though. It's the shrimp. Some of y'all niggas know how to find no the shrimp. shrimp up. Too hard. I ain't gonna cap. The shrimp is hard. Don't give me now no the sh- fish. The fish is the bread. Oh yeah, fish. Fish hard. Yeah, fish harder than shrimp. Especially fish, if fish up, harder than chicken. Yeah, I like that. That's yeah, two I take that back. That's hard to get. I, I right? like crab legs more than I like hot dogs and shit. Like all that shit. Right. Pork is at I the bottom of my hot list. Dog. Pork is at the bottom of my yeah, list. Yeah, we I can't do the pork, man. I ain't ate pork in a while, man. Unless I ate some like. I'm oh, not you. What, what kind of bacon you? You get turkey bacon. Turkey bacon, sir. We got it. Told y'all, y'all get the turkey bacon, man. I get turkey bacon. That's the way to go. I get man. turkey everything. I don't know how the hell they getting that shit to move like that. Shit, fire. How, how you think they is doing that though? Like all the food as far as supplying. What do you think they doing to the food? It's called livestock. You think it's enough livestock to feed all, like, for us to go to? If anybody want a hundred piece right now, they can get right. it from a wing spot. Think about it, bro. If we can see, like, random, just we can, we can see chickens. And you know how you just seen, like, random chickens? Niggas don't always kill their chickens, though. You can just see random chickens all around, bro, on some shit. Like, I feel like, damn, I'm really forgetting what I'm trying to say, but. You yeah, can see them hoes, to? I'm saying, if you can see them hoes on a regular, bro, then that means it's enough. You know what I'm saying? Like, if, if it wasn't enough, they'll be talking about them hoes going extinct. Yeah. Or they'll be, like, overusing them to where you don't even see them no more. Or you think, are they duplicating? You think they're duplicating? Cloning. You, they're you, cloning? You, you think they're cloning uh, chicken? Nah, I don't. And you making know, shit. I don't fucking know. And I don't know what chicken. these people got going on. We don't know what the fuck they doing, nah, honestly. That's one thing I can't speak on is cloning. Now, if that shit possible, that shit weird. Cloning is possible. Why are you cloning when I just it's, know. it's so easy to make a child? A child, like another person, like another like another person. chicken. I'm just saying, like, yeah, 
type shit. Oh, like, right. But it's not. But you know what I'm saying. It, it can only take so much. As far as like the birth process, right. if niggas hungry, why is niggas even fake shit though? <clears throat> Why are niggas even processing so much into one package to where we need, <laughs> so where we fiending for that shit? Why yeah, are niggas I'm doing that lie. though? Why is, why is you <clears throat> putting fucking thirty slabs of fucking turkey in a mo- in the fucking what a jumbo pack? Fucking turkey uh, on God, turkey on God, bacon. Though. Why is you even showing that to niggas to, that they can eat that though? Thirty piece chicken. Yeah. Like why why are you telling niggas they can eat that much anyway? That shit should be that shit should be too much to buy. But it's kind of like Nah it's kind of like So you gotta keep going to the store Like you can have it You ain't gotta nah, cook it all at one time I'm talking about like From like fast food too though That's mm-hmm. when I was saying 30 piece chicken Oh But with like Packed oh, up meats Oh like, Why you want it, 30 they had, they had like a family meat? though Huh And they had a family pack Like you talking about like that But niggas be eating family packs <laughs> I eat a family pack 30 I eat, I eat family size cereal I can't cap oh, That yeah, shit Some niggas That shit ain't nothing but another bowl <laughs> Y'all weird niggas They give you one more bowl So Weird niggas be eating out of Plastic bowls and last spoons, nigga. Not eat no cereal, hey, nigga. Cra- cra- Gotta go big spoon, nigga. Crazy, cra- <laughs> crazy thing is, bro. Is niggas just don't care about what they eat out of. It's just cereal. The cereal gonna be hard regardless. But get what though? I got me a new bowl. If you he eat, ain't seen it though. He ain't seen it. I if got you me a eat, new bowl, if so you eat cinnamon crazy. toast crunch on a spoon, right on a last spoon, you maybe get like four or five of them. But if you eat like on a spoon, what I got, you may get like eight, nine. Whatever nigga like this, like to the savor their meal. So you just want soggy ass cereals? That's just all be, I'm saying. See, just because you eat Frosted Flakes all the time don't mean. No, I don't eat Frosted Flakes all the time, bro. Ho, man, I, I like Captain Crunch too, nigga. Nigga, you said they fuck up the roof of your mouth, nigga. I ain't roof, say that. Whole roof of bro mouth are hanging. No. Shit hanging. No, no. I Captain Crunch hard though. Captain Crunch is hard. Ten out of ten. I may go buy some cereal soon. Ten out of ten. Very soon. Really, really, we can go get some cereal tonight though. We can go to um, Walmart. Go to Kroger. Walmart like right around. I got a Kroger card, so I want to. I want to get my points. He so. want one dollar off. It don't add up nowhere. He just want one dollar off. You gotta save. <laughs> I'm on my coupon on shit. Se- on select, <laughs> on select cereals though. He on finna, select cereals. I ain't even gonna get what I force him. God, to get. I ain't even gonna get what I want. I'm gonna get. I'm, I'm gonna get what they got on, on selection. Honey Smacks, two fifty a box. Oh. Nigga gonna be over that bit like hell no. Nah. Nigga go, nigga gonna blow it, bro. Like, I ain't never had, I ain't never had this smack before. Don't even use the goddamn, don't even use the goddamn Kroger Plus card no more after that. Niggas no, gonna be in go. anything. I think I'm gonna to cinnamon toast crunch this time. I ain't had that in a minute. I think I'm finna buy a fat ass off brand bag of like fruity pebbles. As you hold over your back, oh, oh, over your side. No, no. Hey, what's the odds? What's the odds you get a fat ass, fat ass bag, a cereal that you gotta hold over your shoulder? I was gonna do that anyway. Mind and shit. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I, like them big ass bags. Oh, that's what I was saying. saying. You looking at me like? I oh, said nah. yes. Oh, for real? Yeah. Man, I need to get up. Yeah. And podcast O twenty one man. <laughs> but yeah, look, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Hi. Okay. <laughs>